Hey guys, this is Barry with FireNiceOutdoorGear.com and I wanted to show y'all two really neat saws that we make that just will make your chores a lot easier and at camp or if you're in a bushcraft camp or in a prepping situation. And if you stay to the end of the video, I'll show you two neat tricks that you can do with your saw and a knife. Stay tuned. Whether you are a survivalist looking for the right gear or an outdoor geek heading into a new adventure, cutting branches to build a shelter or start a fire is easiest when you own one of the best camping saws. There appears to be this misconception when traversing the fantastic outdoors seeking wood for a campfire or to create a refuge, a wood chopping axe is the only instrument you want. The reality is, you can certainly get by using an axe, hatchet, or tomahawk in case you'd like to, but it's not the perfect instrument for your job in the event of bigger pieces of timber or whenever you would like clean cuts. For those conditions, a camp saw is vital. A folding saw is an excellent addition to anyone's outdoor kit due to their light weight, and being easy to pack, it will fit in just about any bushcraft pack or even bug out bag. The market is full of choices, but the hard part is finding a camping saw designed to live up to the expectations. Luckily, we did the hard part for you. Whether you're going out camping, trekking, or being just a good prepper and survivalist, the best folding saw should be part of your arsenal to ensure that you can saw, chop, and whittle your way through a number of tasks. So, check out our selection of the best camping saws on the market today and choose the model that meets your outdoor needs best. So thanks for sticking around. I wanted to show you one of two of the tricks that could help you in the field. Cut you a piece of wood just like this and you take your saw and put about a hand length right here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna saw all the way around I normally do is go the length of my blade. We're going to work ourselves all the way around. That's how you make a hammer in the woods to put stakes in the ground, do crafts. Now you got a hammer now that you made in the woods. Let me show you one more trick that'll make this saw, that'll make cutting easier. Come on. If you find two Ys and cut them almost identical, they don't have to be perfect. You can put those two together and you can make yourself a sawhorse. Let me show you how it's done. And that just makes it so much easier. Hey guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. I want you,